turn one been a real point of interest and anybody there in the glamping that's there this year I noticed which is a new one on me to the right hand side of boundary road Fast. and there is a pass for the lead down into the Bentley elbow the 22 car manages to go and get around and Jamie Winkup fights back immediately right in behind that Andy Suchek driven big big bulbous Bentley and he's got back by him wow. drafted through used at the draft from the Bentley that was smart motoring there from Jamie Winkup SVG yeah, and him are still on the he runs long and watch leave goes SGV and here comes the Porsche for the second and third duking it out as if this was the last lap or the first lap well, they traded paint last year in the Supercars Championship and wink up all over the back of the AMG as they run down the hill Van Gisbergen is under immense pressure. Worth pointing out, technically it's Red Bull HRT drivers from the supercars, one, two, three, because Matt Campbell was announced recently as a co-driver to Van Gisbergen in the Enduros. But that doesn't matter right now, because Wink Cup is in the tow. He pulls out alongside the AMG for the race lead. There's contact, there's paint, there's dust and debris, and he goes through and grabs the lead. My goodness. They were so close to disaster there. A bit of rubbing as SVG comes round the outside into the chase. This is going to be all or nothing for the 22 car. They know that if this, if this Mercedes AMG can't get back past the bright red Ferrari, they are in real trouble. And that might just be the move of the race. The story of the race, the tail of the tip, will show that pole position car led the most race laps, had the fastest race lap, and then went on to win the race by a full lap. But that barely scratches the surface of the 2017 Little Molly Bathurst 12 hours. It's been an extraordinary drive by everyone in the 88. Tony Vlander with a hero stint in the last third, and Jamie Wincup jumping into that car and taking up where Vlander left off. Possibly the best driving I've ever seen from Vlander, and it is once again the fact that Bathurst delivers the Alan Simonson Trophy taken by this team yesterday, and they'll bring the bright red car home to win it round the final corner. 2017 belongs to the 88. Ferrari win at Bathurst for the second time. They back up their 2014 victory with a win to kick off the 2017 Australian motor racing season.